Hey guys, this isn't actually part two of how to copy DVD onto DVD-R. Um, this is basically just troubleshooting. So if you don't have any problems, you don't really need this. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, what it's just gonna show you is how to use DVD Fab because DVD Shrink can't. Um, mm. There's some issues with DVD Shrink if you have certain DVDs. Um, yeah. That's pretty much it. I did screenshots before I did voices, so did the words or whatever. You wanna consider it? So, um, they might not match up perfectly. I'll try to do as best as I can, but bear with me. Sometimes after you load the disc, it'll say the disc is RCE protected. You can just exit out of that, and it'll bring you to ISO image file. And then after that, sometimes it might say there's a copy protection error. This doesn't always happen. Sometimes it'll just continue to work. Um, exit out of that and open DVD Fab. When you open DVD Fab, the disk will load right away. When the disk is done loading, you click start and it'll record the DVD. Then when it's done, it'll say it's completed, and you can click finish and exit out. You don't have to click finish though, you can just exit out. Either way, works. Then you go back to DVD shrink and open disk instead of, oh no, open file instead of open disk. Then when you go down to the DVD fab, it'll say full disk. Click on the actual title of the disk, not the video TS or audio TS. Then it'll load when that's done click on backup again and then it should work perfectly like it would if there were no protection yeah that sounds really bad but anyways that's it i hope it works